Welcome everybody. Uh, good morning. Um, so, as you know that this is the 14th school, and I'm very happy to say that okay, this is a school which started here in 2010, and it has been going on for a long time. And so, you all of you, I mean, we have chosen you from a pool of applications from more than 200. So, so you should keep in mind that uh, attendance is uh, mandatory, not optional. So please try to attend all the lectures, okay? And so it's a two-week program, so okay, some courses will be hard, some courses will be distinct, but you will learn from all these courses. So it's a mandatory that you attend all the courses. It's not, you cannot, you don't have the option of choosing which course you want to attend and which course you don't want to attend, okay? So with that, I'll just uh, like to invite our director to say a few things. Okay, good morning. Uh, I'm not about to give you a lecture, but uh, so welcome to Raman Research Institute. Uh, many of you must have been here before, and uh, I'm particularly delighted that the school is being held here in the Platinum Jubilee year of uh, Raman Research Institute. As Sanjeev mentioned, that this is a very well-known school which has been going on for 14 years, right? And I understand the, you know, driving force behind it. Abhishek is here. He is at ICPS now, and Abhishek and uh, Sanjeev. Uh, I'm, I'm not sure if anyone else is from ICTS, but I'm really very happy to see, uh, you know, ICTS and RRI join hands in uh, these, uh, you know, various activities that uh, we reach out to students. I should also mention that. Uh, there is a regular gravitational wave school which uh, ICTS were organizing, and I understand from this year it's uh, again uh, probably borrowing from you or whichever way. It's called the Bangalore School on Gravitational Waves, and RRI is also participating in it. Uh, I mean, we don't have faculty to offer, but we have, uh, you know, uh, support that we have been providing to that. So similarly, uh, again. Uh, you know, Abhishek being a senior person at ICTS, I'd really invite uh, him to convey the message back to Rajesh and others that, you know, I think uh, RRI and possibly even ICTS gains by joining hands on as many opportunities. Uh, so I see a lot of young minds and, you know, many years back I have been sitting where you are sitting in schools, not, not statistical physics, obviously. Uh, but uh, I do, you know, want to emphasize what uh, Sanjeev said. You know, typically we, you know, build up prejudices very early, and we feel that, oh my god, that course is not really important, this is important, this is not. I mean, after your hairs have turned gray and all, you realize that, you know, you can really not predict. So it's good to be attending all the courses and try to get whatever you can, okay? You should also appreciate the amount of effort that the lecturers are putting in uh, to bring this to you, right? These schools are quite valuable and you'll find them valuable, if not now, I'm sure later in life if you're continuing in this uh, field. So with these words, uh, I'll again, Hopefully you'll have all a uh, great time here. And if there are any issues with your stay and all, please let Sanjeev know. And I also welcome the lecturers uh, who've come here. Uh, and uh, you know, we're going to spend time here. I hope you'll enjoy our hospitality, and you know, this will be a pleasant stay. Thank you very much. Yeah. So we'll also have tutorials. So we, the format of the school is basically, so we have three lectures, two lectures in the morning. So these are one and a half hour lectures. And then uh, as you see that there's a tutorial. Uh, so tutorial, usually we leave it open to the lecturers, how they want to conduct it. Uh, so this can be used uh, for, if you have any doubts, of course you can stop the lecturer in the middle. So this it's, it's supposed to be, interactive and you can ask questions and if you don't ask questions then lecturer will ask you questions basically and but if you have some doubts even after the lecture so you can use the tutorial sessions to clarify your doubts 
Also, depending on the lecture, some lecturers might actually give you some problem during the lecture or leave something, skip some details here, and you are supposed to work it out, okay? And if you have some problem, then you can just ask the lecturers in the tutorial session. And so usually, I think, so what we have found is that uh, it's because since you don't have much time, right, you have like a three courses, it goes all the way to four, and then you have half an hour, then tutorial starts. So usually if you form a mini group of, let's say four or five students and discuss the problem among yourself, that actually works out better and it also gives you a, it's an early start of this collaboration which you do later, right? So maybe you can, if you, if you stuck something or like, Basically, any problem you have something, just form a group of four or five students and just discuss as a group. Yeah. Is there anything else you want to add? I think that's it. Okay.